Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Tuba Player Negative AE. We're back in front of Hotel Mirai. Uh, we're just continuing. I, I, I haven't stopped. <laughs> I should probably stop. But uh, I don't know. I'm getting tired of reading, so maybe I'll maybe I'll get tired of reading. Who's in the lobby? Anybody? I'm glad. Even the inside of this place looks grand too. If this was really a normal school trip, I'd be smiling by now. But why are we the only ones in the hotel? Now, now. Now, it's an uninhabited island. It can't be helped. For the uninhabited island, this uh, hotel looks pretty well kept. The electricity doesn't seem, uh, won't be an issue. It seems the electricity won't be an issue. What in the world is going on in this island? Um, anything to explore in this? Arcade machine. Hello. This place even has an arcade machine. Isn't it great? This sure is a grand hotel. Uh, we're at like an inn in the hot springs district or something. All right, I guess I'll meet you. State your business. State your business. All business, girl, huh? Are you a business lady or a golfer? Introduction. Understood. Understood. I don't mind. My name is. I'm Hajime My name you. is Peko Pekoyama. It is nice to meet you too. Okay. Ultimate Swordsman. Oh shit. Okay. Actually. Okay, so she's gonna be crazy. Uh, so unbelievable with a cute name like Peko Pakiyama could be so spy. You're 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 namest. Uh, I've heard that she's an adult man and she doesn't even stand a chance against her. Well, there's definitely something up with her. Her eyes are really insane. It appears. If what Rib Rabbit said is to, is true, we are expected to live together on this island. Yeah, you're right. It's necessary for men and women who live together to respect each other. So don't try anything inappropriate. Oh, th personalities are already conflicting. Like, already conflicting. I would prefer not to kill anyone. You're gonna set it off, aren't you? Um, kill, isn't that sword on your back only made of the bamboo? Yes. It may seem impossible to kill someone with this, but a misaimed blow can be fatal. Well... Well, an aimed blow can be fatal too. Dots. I'll keep that in mind. Okay, nice to know that you can just kill any- that's- just kill anybody at the thing. Dots. There's some girl playing an arcade game and she looks completely- are you the ultimate gamer? You are, you have an Atari, or not uh, not an Atari thing, like a Galaga. Oh, Hajime. good. Hajime, you haven't properly introduced her. Yeah, you're right. Seems she's focused on her game, but I guess I just tried to talk to her. Excuse me, I'd like to introduce myself. Dots. Hey! Hey, Chikaki. <gasps> uh, I must have been a little too focused on my game. Uh, a little, are you sure about that? Um, All right, introductions, got it. Dots. I'm Chiaki Nanami. The ultimate gamer. Yes. Video games are my hobby, and I'm a fan of all genres. Same, kind of. Yeah. You know what? I'm not a fan of I'm not a fan of mobile games. Mobile games kind of piss me off a little bit. But nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I like every other game. Ultimate gamer. Nice to meet you. I'm Hajime Hinata. Nice to meet you too. Dots. Yep. Yeah, totally. Seems like this conversation. This is exactly how I am. <laughs> well, she is gaming right now. Well, more, it's more like dots. I'm the kind of person who gathers my thoughts before I. Can. Dude, me and this girl are exactly the same. Like, I can't talk unless I've already prepared something I wanted to say in my head, especially when meeting new people. Well, if I get used to them, I can talk usually a little faster. I agree. See, we relate so much. You're gonna get killed first, aren't you? Uh, we're still focused on my game. She hasn't looked at me at all. The ultimate gamer, she knows how to play video games at a time like this. And she sleeps. Oh, good. Alright, who, uh, who haven't I met yet? Hold on. Report card. Alright, I haven't met you yet. I haven't met you yet, but I've met everyone else. So there's two people left that I have not met. I'm guessing there are... Oh no, they're not upstairs. That's where the, the thing is. So how do I leave? How do I leave? Oh, R. R to exit. I like to go outside. 
All right. So that's the extent of this hotel. That's pretty crazy. So if I just walk around, can I gain level like crazy? What's the point to level, really, though? How's my pet doing? How's my pet going? Does my pet do anything? Wait. Wait, she needs... I need to clean. There we go. There we go. Every so often, I should just check and clean the cage. Alright. So there's the hotel. Now I just need to find the last two people, which are probably on the farm. Or the ranch. And then we'll end the episode, and we'll finally have meeting everybody, and then we can get on with the story. You saw me corral. Alright. This looks like a ranch. But there aren't many animals here. Right? Uh, you found it out. You again? Seriously, where do you keep appearing from? I think it's weird too. Dude. I... Uh, I can show up anywhere, anytime. This system allows me to appear anywhere on this island. It's all thanks to this handy dandy magic stick. Magic stick, huh? With the store Chloe she's talking about? Still, I'm quite troubled. A ranch without any moo cows is like a soccer team without any balls. <laughs> you might want to rephrase that. Alrighty, Alrighty just leave it, leave it to me and my handy dandy magic stick. Do not turn that chicken into a cow. Wow. Okay. Wow. Oh, a huge success. What was that just now? A chicken turned into a cow? That's not it. It's probably some sort of trick or illusion. It was probably set up before we got here. She was probably trying to make us happy, but I guess it had the opposite effect on you, Hanjime. A trick? An illusion? Well, if you think rationally, it makes sense. A chicken can't just change into a cow. Messing with living things is just not cool, you know? Okay. So, there's a bird that I want to examine first. Tropical bird. It's a toucan. What do you mean, tropical bird? It's a toucan. Let's talk to you. Squish, squish. Oh, you're cute. What is this kid doing? She keeps sitting down and pressing her finger on the floor with all her strength. I haven't int uh, are you okay? I haven't introduced myself, right? My name is Hajime Hinata. Mm -hmm. Hmm? I'm Hiyoko Sayonji. Sayonji. I like that name. Ultimate traditional dancer. What kind of freaking ultimate is that? I don't understand. She hasn't stopped pressing her fingers onto the floor. Seriously, what she's doing? What's she doing? And her appearance and voice are so young. I can't believe she's actually a high school student. Actually, actually, uh, I don't know. Uh, as a rookie uh, Japanese dancer, the industry expects a lot from her. She's already performed. Uh, it seems her performances are very popular among audiences, which is rare in the Japanese dance industry. Well, then again, her fans are mostly men. It's probably because she looks so young. Her fans probably have, uh, all have the same niche or something. Squish! Or niche. Squish! Squish. Uh, what exactly mm -hmm. are you doing? I'm squishing. Squishing what? Mr. Ants! Duh! Uh, okay. Come again? <laughs> No! Kill your ants, kill them. I hate ants. I hate ants, but I don't want to squish them. Your attitude doesn't match your performance at all. Tend to hope fragment. I'm glad that uh, she's squishing the ants, though, because I hate ants. The ants are the worst. I, I'll just, I, I don't want to examine the cow, because I know he's going to say the same. Yo! Hey, who are you dudes? It's nice to meet you. I'm Hajime Hinata. Gotcha. And who's this other dude? What? What? We haven't already met? <laughs> oh, haha, ha, I'm sorry. I pretty much suck at remembering names. So, I've, I've met so many interesting characters today. I'm Nagato Kamida. Uh, if you can, please don't forget my name again. Yo! The name's Akane Owari. Nice to meet ya. Who are you? Like the ultimate MILF? Ultimate gymnast. I like it. Well... Akame is known as the ultimate gymnast and an all-round super athlete. Rumor has it she's a wild troublemaker, but her athletic, ath athletic, athletic ability is off the charts. However, her basics and fundamentals are all over the place, so her gymnastic routines are mostly improvised. A 
If she's in her groove, she performs uh, splendidly, but if she's not, she loses interest and switches it up. What's self-centered? No matter how you cut it, she definitely sounds like- What? No, she doesn't. Ultimate gym- Maybe he's- Maybe I'm the ultimate skeptic. Maybe that's what I am. Can't visualize her as a normal high school. I mean, she's got the physique of an Olympic athlete. And she's hot. What? Like her, uh, uh, don't tell me. Uh, oh, you have a thing for sexy bodies, huh? You're being really loud, and I know you're doing that on purpose. All right. So that's that. Let's go to the map. Oops. I keep thinking it's escape, but it's not. Okay. Map. Okay. So. Boom. Okay, so I'm at the ranch. Here's where I am. Oh, this is the hotel. Okay, so I can just instantly warp to places. What is this? Have I been here before? Have I been here before? Can I go? Okay. I'd like to go there. Can I go here? What is the central Hajime. island? It looks like if we go across this bridge, we can reach another island not far from here. Don't auto. Is it safe? That's where we're going to find out. If it's not safe when we get there, what'll you do? The central island. All right, thank you guys for watching. Um, on this island, we'll explore a little bit and we'll see what's going on. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Remember to like the video if you liked it and uh, subscribe if you feel necessary. Um, it helps you know that I'm doing something right. And comment if you want to have a conversation because maybe I'm doing something wrong. Um, that, that's not cool. Anyway, uh, peace out, guys.